Hey, this is Tom Hunting coming to you from smoky Northern California. And the smoke is clearing, I think. Yeah. It means it's gonna be a good fucking day for metal. I have a house here in the mountains and a giant man cave and Gary and I have been working on this music since early July. Drumsticks, they're not just for drumming anymore, they're for scratching too. <laughs> we started having what I call jam camps. We would drink beer at night and then by day we would spend about five or six hours in my jam room. Let's try something. Yeah, let's do it. Just working out arrangements and kind of putting the meat and potatoes of all this music together. I call the drums the bread, the riffs are the meat, the bread holds the riffs together, and everything else is like condiments. We decided that the vocals would be called cheese, because, you know, most singers are cheesy. Every day in the mountains is awesome. Yeah. <laughs> Another day in paradise. We all convened here on August 26th, and I think that day or the next day, a truck backed into my driveway. <laughs> with two giant pallets of recording gear, microphones, rack mounted shit that I don't, does I don't even know what, but hopefully makes us sound badass. We hired um, Steve Lagudi, a good friend of ours. He's been on tour with us a couple times. He's very detail oriented. He takes a lot of notes. He dresses all hard and wears these black clothes, but he's kind of nerdy. What are you doing down there? Finally getting to move this chill. <laughs> You look comfortable, Steve. Yeah, this is nice. Steve got his ear spanked but today. But you know what? Most Checking importantly, we got it in one day. Any hard logistical thinking process, like the band's not even involved. We don't even have to think about stuff because we know that he's already written it down. You know, I've been up here jamming for years. Like whenever there's a tour coming up, if it's summertime and I'm up here, I'll come up here for two weeks and play the drum.